Hey guys, this is Tom Fleming, and uh, today I'm going to give you a free art lesson on how to create watercolor effects with uh, graphite and pencil. Um, basically, I'm going to start off, I have a smooth surface Bristol board on, uh, on the desk, and I'm going to take a nice, clean, uh, soft cloth, and I have some graphite powder that I'm just going to uh, pick up, and I just wrap it around. You could actually use a tissue, you can use uh, anything. Uh, a tissue paper, uh, an old sock, whatever you'd like, as long as it's soft and, it, uh, and it, uh, that you get that graphite to cling to it. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of create these, sh some shapes here. And uh, they're just going to be kind of random shapes. And I'm smudging, I'm pressing, and I'm really pressing and smudging into the bristle. And we can make a, some dots here and there, like so. And they're nice, soft, they're nice, soft uh, shapes with no real uh, edge to them. Then I'm going to take a uh, blending stump. This is a number four blending stump. It's a medium, uh, medium size, and it has a nice, um, nice sharp point to it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to just pick up a little bit of the uh, graphite, and I'm going to find some of the edges of my shapes here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create just a, uh, a U-shaped pattern right around the edges. I'm going to, and I'm going to press down and go around this shape. And I'm not going to do it everywhere. I'm going to leave some of the edges soft. And what that's going to do is that basically creates this a kind of pseudo um, bleeding effect, and uh, and you could do you can even go, do a couple on the inside, here and there. And maybe on the and then you could lighten it up and do some the, the nice heavy ones really create the effect, and maybe at the bottom, just. Go around the edge. And then you could just let some of them just really bleed off the edges. And what you have here is um, it looks like almost like a uh, uh, an ink wash where you laid it down and you can uh, you can even make some of them longer and um, and it looks like that it's watercolor bleeding into the paper. Um, hope that helped. Uh, give it a try. Pick up some blending stumps. Uh, get your soft cloth and your uh, and your Bristol paper and give it a try. And uh, be sure to check out my website at www.flemingeditions.com and check out my book Draw and Paint Fantasy Females. Thanks for watching.